and my name is Meg Finley, and I'm a screen monitor with the Loudoun Wildlife Conservancy. This video is the first in a series that will demonstrate the technique that the Wildlife Conservancy uses to monitor streams throughout Loudoun County, Virginia. The methodology that we use was developed by the Virginia Save Our Streams program. It is applicable for a ripple area in a stream, which is composed of cobbles and rocks, 2 to 10 inches in diameter, and generally stream depth between 2 and 10 or 12 inches. Human activities throughout Loudoun County can contribute a variety of different types of pollution that impact and can actually compromise stream health. Organic pollution can come from wastewater treatment facilities. The elements nitrogen and phosphorus found in fertilizers also enter the stream environment through agricultural runoff. Toxic pollutants uh, from industry, as well as gas and oil that run off our roadways, also enter the stream environment and can be detrimental. And finally, sediments can also pollute the environment, the stream environment. Uh, in our area, these generally come from construction, new development sites, and also some agricultural areas. A good way to assess the impact of pollution on the stream environment is to evaluate the ability of the stream to support aquatic life. This methodology, using this equipment that we will show you today, uh, will enable us to sample the aquatic invertebrates that live on the stream bottom. Now, invertebrates are animals without a backbone. These are organisms such as snails, aquatic insects, some worms, and also crayfish. 